So I'm here in my normal spot. Just been announced that Alex Neal will not be um, in charge for today's game. Not officially left, but he won't be there for today's game. Um, and I think even if he didn't take the job in Stoke, he can't he can't come back now to to go off and miss a very important one of the most important games, maybe even the most important game so far in the season. Um, at home to Norwich, I kept saying Stoke in yesterday's video because that's on my mind. Norwich, we're against um, live in a couple of hours, and yeah, he's not in charge of that. So uh, obviously, if we win, fantastic. But if we lose that, like all, uh, that's his fault. I mean, we're going to blame him no matter what, no matter even if you know we got a couple of red cards, whatever, it doesn't matter. The point is. Is his fault he's not there for the team and that be playing with their minds, the player's minds. Um, and I I think we're going to lose this one now, and I think we'll lose 2 0. And I really do think it will affect the player sometime, it can affect them in a good way. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go with a 2 0. But anyway, Nuki um, v Bovi, obviously at Bovi today, just down the road. And I'll tell you a bit of information about them. So we can keep our mind of Sunderland. Well, the game would have been over by then. And I can actually enjoy some football where to when I don't really mind what the score is. Although it would be nice for Bovi, a local team, to win that one and go into the next round. And maybe even I'll go to that next round of them if they get to it. So yeah, a bit of information. Let's get into it. Bovi Tracy, best FA VAR um, performance. And they actually got to the first round proper. So I think that's maybe three rounds on from today's match. Which is not too bad at all. They play in Millmarsh Park, which is their ground name, which is about half a mile that way. And we'll be walking down today, having a drink or two um, before the game also. Um, nicknamed the Moorlanders and play in the Southwest Peninsula Premier East Division. So yeah, that's a bit about Bovi. They were also founded in 1950, so not actually a massive amount of time ago. Now going on to Newquay and their best um, FA Varg performance in the fourth round. So they got very far along there, very close to getting to Wembley. They're actually nicknamed the Peppermints. I'm not actually too sure why, I don't know if that's what colour Newquay are, but um, yeah, nicknamed the Peppermints. They uh, play in the South West Peninsula Premier West. So it's a league that literally joint, so it's not above, not below, it's joint to just like the National League um, North and South. So they'll both two one team, I think, will go up in each into the next one. Maybe there's a playoff again, so maybe four teams go up. Not too sure of the complete layout, but yeah, so they are the same level. So it um, will be an interesting game. They play there home fixtures and lovely new key in uh, Mount Wise Stadium which had a quick look actually looked very nice and they were founded quite a long time ago in 1890 but they haven't got a lot of record to show for it other than in, in the lower league um, but still uh, they're still one of the bigger Corn Cornwall teams uh, Choro being the biggest because um, Cornwall just don't have um, I guess the players that uh, want to go there to play I'm not too sure why Cornwall don't have a big team but yeah we're going to be teams in Cornwall actually maybe the third biggest but yeah I'll see you very soon we'll be meeting Chris in about an hour and um, yeah watching the Sunderland game and also we want to watch the Man United game so I think I'll split screen it so we can watch it both keep like we're playing the PlayStation like back in the, the old days I think there's a, a cricket match here as well today that they're setting up for. Yeah, won't waffle on too much. See you very soon at Milmosh Park. Bobby Tracy versus Nuki. Nice ball. 
on the throw. He is a decent player. This one. Get out, call him out. Oh, get that. Oh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 That's a great yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah. So apart from missing one of the goals, it was actually Bobby Tracy 5, Newquay 0 and um, Bobby Tracy are at home to Welton Rovers in the second qualifying round of the FA Vars, which I believe I'm probably going to have to go to. Obviously my choice, but I think I will be going to that one. Um, so Sunderland lost 1-0. Thank you Alex Neal, that was your fault. Um, look forward to going to probably a Buckland game next, but I'm going to have to look because I have nothing planned at the moment until Swansea away with Sunderland on the 8th of October. So yeah, thank you for watching. We'll see you very soon.